That's what you need to know, Lou. Here's what I want you to know. There you go. Thank you very much, Lou. You know, today, it's a special day for Browns fans all over the world. We celebrate our friend Joe Thomas being elected to the Pro Football Hall of Fame. And that's a word I don't use lightly. Friend. You rarely get to use that word with athletes anymore. Joe played his entire career in Cleveland. And while he's from Brookfield, Wisconsin, he could very well be from Brunswick, Ohio. From 2007 to now, Joe has been through every moment, good and bad, of the Browns right along with us. You watched every snap. He played every snap. And in the end, while there's so many players that we've had to question, we know Joe on a first-name basis because he's one of the best friends Browns fans could ever have. In August, Browns fans will descend upon Ken and support and celebrate Joe Thomas because that's what we do for our friends. Today, we have pride in knowing that generations of football fans will soon know what we've known for so long. To meet Joe is to know Joe. To know Joe is to love Joe. Joe's play has made him an immortal. Browns fans know it's Joe's character that's made him a legend. Send your tweets to me at Ken Carmen, C-A-R-M-A-N, and I'll talk to everybody bright and early at 6 a.m. with my good buddy Anthony Lima on 92.3 The Fan. Couldn't have said it better. He is just such a good guy. Wonderful man. Yeah, yeah, Wonderful man. Got to speak to him this morning. He yeah. broke up this morning oh. uh, while he was talking about Walter Jones coming to see him to, to tell him he made the Hall of Fame. It was a wonderful moment. Yeah, so happy and so proud that he spent his entire NFL yeah. career right here in Cleveland. What a guy. Thank yes. you, Ken. Thank you, Thank you very much.